the Maneuver Center of Excellence change of command took place on the National Infantry Museum parade field. Friends, family, soldiers, and supporters gathered to bid farewell to Major General H.R. McMaster and welcomed Major General Austin Scott Miller. Our Army is a living historical community. And for those of us who continue to serve, for Scott Miller, myself, and others, it's our duty to preserve the legacy of excellence we have inherited from those who have gone before us. General Miller replaces General McMaster as the fourth commander of the MCOE and the 54th commander to take the reins at Fort Benning. General Miller previously served as the commander of NATO Special Operations Component Command Afghanistan. As I come in here today, I'm, I'm as about as excited as this assignment as I've been of any assignment I've had in the U.S. military. Lieutenant General Kevin Mangum and Command Sergeant Major Timothy Gooden were present to help pass the command to the hands of Fort Benning's newest commanding general. General Miller greeted the Fort Benning community for the first time with words of wisdom for his new Army family. Coming home to Fort Benning is a pretty special assignment for me. There's a lot of reasons, uh, but when you break it all down, it's the people, it's the missions, you, when you couple those together, then you add the community, that makes it a very special place, and that, those are the ingredients for a great assignment. David Wright, Fort Benning TV.